You find a little love and give it back again Is it supposed to be this hard? Cause you're tired of sitting here on your own Yeah, you're tired of the feeling that you need someone You found your peace no matter where you are all right, so it's windy season nowadays in Bali. As you see, so many people are flying kites everywhere in the sky. You will see so many beautiful kites. It's like behind me right now, there are a group of kids are flying kites. Wow! So as you can see, some of the kites, they are really huge, like this one is like a three, four, five meters. And yeah, this is how it is. That's the hobby of local people, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's so cool. And it's very windy season, by the way. That's why it's a little bit cloudy, but it's very good, very big wind. That's why it's the good, uh, uh, good weather for the flying kites. Not good for flying drones. <laughs> So as you see that the hobby of flying kites actually is not only for the small kids but adults yeah. they also love flying kites you see later yes. on look like even even like uh, very very adults all these people like all also uh, they playing kites like this guy check this out <laughs> As you see, so many kids are here flying kites. They are so happy. They are laughing. Also, adults. You see an adult flying kite. I will not but I will not break it. I just try. Wow. So strong. I'm afraid though. Which one is this? That one, the black one. Black one, you see? Yeah. And then have a look at the string. It's so strong. Whenever you pull it over, pull it like that, you need to pull it with minimum three or four kids. Look at them. See? They are so happy. Senang gak main layangan? Senang. Dah sekolah ni? Dah. Dah. Ini udah ada tarik dah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Mari pulang pulang. Ayo, Mbak. Hello, how are you? 
Fine, thank you. How about you? Oh, still alive. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding, just joking. <laughs> just wanna make you smile, you know? Yes, smile. But been done. You got me out. As you can see, the people enjoying the kids, the all these, the all the families actually, because of the small kids with the like like you saw, like a full families, they are just happy enjoying. And this is the proper way how you fly the kite in Bali, in the, in the rice, rice field, field, on the beach, or somewhere on the very open area. And later we're gonna show you how you should not fly the drone in Bali. So flying kites. You should not fly kites in the place. What I said drone? Yeah. Uh, yeah, sorry. Sorry, my apologies. So next time we will show you how to do not fly the kite in Bali. Stay tuned. and this is what you just saw the fly the kites are everywhere in the city in the residential area on the main roads um, in the pasar in sanur else everywhere around the bali and this is the way of how you should not fly and this is just because it's danger it's not about the uh, how it looks or something it's just the danger already three people die in bali uh, this is because the string, as you saw before, is very strong, right? And the kite is very easy to fall down and sometimes they crossing the road and the rope, the string is just crossing the street. So imagine if you're driving the bike, let's say, just 50 km per hour, maybe 60, I'm not gonna say 100 or more. You just gonna get an accident and you know what's gonna happen. I, I, I don't wanna tell that because this is um, so drastic, but you're gonna die and that's serious problem however that's the beautiful tradition uh, in Bali whenever you fly in safely places like beach beaches parks um, rice fields and everything is totally fine but because of so many people flying the in the residential area because of uh, current situation and was the lockdown and everything is so many kites everywhere and you just have to be careful and that will be enough for today's vlog like always thank you so much for watching i hope so you like it and new vlog every day 7 pm bali time please subscribe like share and see you tomorrow you
something that you know Oh, you try to find 